Hello, and welcome to this demonstration of Atlantis Ilio Persistent VDI 4.0 Storage Optimization Software. In this video, I will be demonstrating a persistent virtual desktop using Atlantis Ilio in-memory storage technology. Ilio allows us to run persistent virtual desktops using RAM as primary storage. You will see that using RAM as storage makes it possible to deploy persistent virtual desktops below the cost of a physical PC saving hundreds of dollars per desktop while delivering a better than PC user experience. Storage is the number one challenge and risk when deploying VDI. What we hear from customers is that the cost and performance of traditional storage makes it impossible to deliver equal or better than physical PC performance at comparable capex. So how much storage do you need to equal physical PC performance? Well, the performance of a desktop is a function of how many IOPS, or input-output operations per second, you have available on the storage system. The more IOPS you can get from your storage, the faster the desktop will perform, and the better the user experience. A standard PC or laptop with a single SATA drive will deliver about 75 IOPS, but a MacBook Air or PC with local flash storage can deliver up to 5,000 IOPS. More and more people are buying personal laptops, desktops, and iPads with local flash storage and are now expecting this type of performance from their desktops at work. As you can see, sizing SAN or NAS storage for even 75 IOPS makes the server and storage cost of a virtual desktop increase to over $3,000. That's five times more than per desktop of a physical PC. The average VDI deployment is sized with around 10 to 30 IOPS, which is one-third to one-quarter the performance of a physical PC. It's no wonder that users aren't happy with their virtual desktops. So let's take a look at the user experience of a virtual desktop with only 50 IOPS compared to an Atlantis Ilio Persistent VDI 4.0 using in-memory storage. Now, one of the most common, important user experience metrics is how fast applications will launch. We'll use Perfmon, and you can see here, a standard Windows utility to monitor the IOPS over time. We'll also time how long it takes. Now, using the hypervisor, we will set the quota for the virtual desktop to 50 IOPS. 50 IOPS being considered on the high side of desktop sizing parameter when calculating storage requirements for VDI. Okay, we have that set. We'll jump back over to our desktop. I'm going to launch several common applications like PowerPoint, Word, Google, and I'll use a script to do that. You can see that script here. We'll do that on both the Limited and the Atlantis desktop. And we'll measure that at 250. We just launched at around 250 on our timer. Fast forward four and a half minutes and we've got all the applications launched. If users see this kind of desktop performance, they'll be inclined to go back to using their original PC. You can see that sizing VDI storage can be risky business. Atlantis Computing is in the business of removing that risk and delivering virtual desktops that are cheaper and faster than even a physical PC. Now let's take a look at launching the same applications on a desktop running on Atlantis Ilio in-memory storage. Here you can see that I've rebooted this system just 40 seconds ago so we know all the read caches and write caches have been flushed. We will run the same script launching the same applications that we did in the previous test. You can see that here, and here we go, we'll launch that script. We don't need a timer in this case, because you can see that the performance is actually better than what you would expect from a physical PC, with literally instant application launches. And here you can see all these applications are fully loaded and usable. This is because we are using RAM as primary storage for the virtual desktops. RAM is the fastest possible storage media with the lowest latency. The launching of applications can generate a surprising amount of IOPS. If the storage doesn't have enough IOPS, the user waits for their application to launch, as we saw previously, 
or for their searches to complete. Here is a Windows 7 performance monitor chart showing how many IOPS each application used. You can see that IOPS demand can easily reach into the thousands to start these apps, with an average IOPS load at over 400 IOs per second. This shows that by providing more IOPS, you can accelerate desktop performance. Another common operation that will hit storage very hard is an Outlook search or a File Explorer search. When we are asked to come in to help with the performance issues of existing VDI rollouts, we'll often see that the administrator has turned off the Windows desktop search and the Outlook search because it is too slow and generates far too many IOPS. You can see that with Atlantis Ilio, the search results appear instantly as you type, allowing your users and customers to find what they need immediately. Even with file searches, PDFs can be brought up from your entire hard drive. Here is a search of actually every file on the hard drive. It comes up instantly. That kind of search can take several minutes on a physical PC. For our final test, let's use a PC benchmarking tool called Passmark to see how fast a virtual desktop on Atlantis Ilio Persistent VDI 4.0 is compared to a physical PC. After Passmark initializes, you can see that it is running through some heavy I.O. using different I.O. profiles. During the benchmark, Atlantis Ilio is handling upwards of 32,000 IOPS on a single desktop during this test run. Now, when it finishes, it will rank the performance of the hard drive on your PC or in this case on the Atlantis Ilio desktop. We'll jump forward to the end of the test and you can see here that our score is 5049. Now let's jump over to the Passmark website and we'll look up our performance with other disks that have been tested in the marketplace. I want to point out that this isn't a dedicated demo environment. We're doing this on internal Atlantis computing desktops with other users working at the same time. You can see that the Ilio performance is almost off the chart, topping the charts as the third fastest drive in the world, over even enterprise level fast drives, and faster than the Apple SSD on a MacBook Air. In conclusion, storage in a persistent VDI deployment represents 40 to 60% of the cost of a virtual desktop, yet delivers disk performance that is four times slower than that of a physical PC. With traditional storage, it simply isn't possible to deploy persistent virtual desktops that have equal or better performance than a physical PC at a comparable cost. Atlantis Ilio makes this possible to deploy persistent virtual desktops that are both cheaper and faster than a PC. Additionally, Atlantis Ilio complements your existing Citrix and VMware VDI solutions. It enables you to deploy VDI with no storage or SSDs. It cuts your CapEx cost and OpEx costs below the cost of a PC while delivering one of the fastest desktops in the world. And Ilio reduces deployment risks by simplifying the architecture and fully automating the deployment.